Welcome to this brief overview of deployments in Morpheus. There are a few ways to create a deployment. One of these ways is by going to Provisioning, Code, Deployments. Click the Add button, give it a name and optional description, and then Save. Select the deployment to view its versions, which initially will be empty. Deployment versions can contain any number of files, from one to hundreds. When adding a version, there will be three options to choose from, File, Fetch, and Git. A file deployment allows users to drag their files directly into the window. Once uploaded, click Save to add the version. Fetch deployments require entering a URL to a file representing the deployment. HTTP authentication options can also be entered if the URL requires some form of basic authentication scheme for access by the appliance. Git deployments let you use either public or private repositories. To utilize a private Git repository, the dialog will show a public key pair here that can be added to the Git service for authentication. It's worth noting that in the current version of Morpheus, this key pair is shared across the account and is not specifically scoped to the user, so it may be advisable to connect this integration to a deployment account in Git. If the Git repository is public, the key pair can be ignored. Next, either an SSH or HTTPS Git URL can be entered containing a Git branch or tag name. Deployments and deployment versions can both be edited by clicking the pencil icon across from their relative names. A full history of backup builds for deployments are kept in Morpheus. Because of that, version rolling backwards or forwards is incredibly easy and can be done from the Deploy tab of an Instances Details page. However, since it's all kept in Morpheus, storage may be a concern. On a fresh appliance, deployment storage is located in var opt Morpheus. This point can be changed by the master account or by creating a storage provider tied to an S3 compatible object store and changing the storage point in Administration, Settings, Provisioning. Hopefully, this brief overview of deployments in Morpheus was helpful. If you have any questions, please see our documentation link below. Thank you.